Ready to learn how to make this cool chart in Excel? Let's break it down step by step. Step 1. Organize your data effectively. Input the months, target sales, and actual sales into separate columns. Compute the variance by subtracting actual sales from target sales, placing the results in a new column, and categorize them into not achieved and achieved based on positive or negative values. Create a helper column to assign clear labels for both categories. Step 2. Head to the Insert tab and click Clustered Column Chart. Go to Chart Design and click Select Data. Add your data to the chart. Watch this. Add a title like Monthly Performance Overview, Jan June 2025, up top. Step 3. Now, let's enhance your chart. Right click on a column and select Format Data Series to customize. Apply a sleek gray color to the base bars for a polished look. Next, add error bars to your chart. Navigate to the Chart Design tab and select Add Chart Element. Choose Error Bars and click Standard Error. Customize the error bars for precision. For the not achieved category, set the direction to minus. Adjust the end style to no cap and set the error amount to custom. Click specify value and link it to the negative variance values in your data. Style the error bars with a red or pink line color and increase the width to 10 for emphasis. Repeat these steps for the achieved category bars. Step 4. Add data labels for better clarity. Click on a helper bar and add data labels. In the label options, check value from cells. Highlight the variance values to display them. Adjust the label position as desired, and set the bar color to no fill for a clean look. Repeat this process for the achieved category. Once all steps are complete, adjust the series gap to 100% and set the gap width to your preference. Remove any unnecessary elements for a polished finish. Save your work. And there you have it. A professional, stunning chart. Love this. Hit that like button, subscribe for more Excel hacks, and ring the bell so you never miss a tip. Catch you in the next one.